All right, you guys, what is going on? This is Redson here. <laughs> I don't know why I said it like that, but we are with the Battlefront 3 era mod once again, finally doing a video on it rather than streaming it. <laughs> and we are on the semi Xbox converted map of Bespin. We are here with the 327th. Let's go ahead and do that. 300 droids we need to kill. Hopefully, it'll be Air Ela Sakura. Sekula. Whatever you want to call it. <laughs> um. Yeah, this best been this best been almost best been converted map is pretty sick. Obviously, I mean I hope Ansem, especially since I was shown this by Cryptic or at least uh, Ansem one of Ansem's videos. Uh, I hope uh, Ansem's able to re like release assets to like some of the Xbox converted platforms and different assets out there because like. Stuff like that bridge over there is supposed to be, there's supposed to be like a circular middle part of it rather than a rec straight rectangle, whatever you want to call it. So hopefully that will be available, maybe. That'd be pretty cool to use. Heck, I might even use it as like a little, for like a map and use it as like a turret in place, or use it for turret emplacements and whatnot. Hey, we could be Ayla. I am almost dead. Yep. <laughs> Sick. Yeah, 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 whatever. I don't even know. I don't even know what I'm talking about anymore. Or right now, anyway. <laughs> Whoa. Ayla going off. Yes. <laughs> nice. Nice, 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 nice. Oh my goodness, it's a Magni Guard. Die. Thank you. Oh, I thought I saw a droid over there. Go faster! Oh, that is adventurous. That is act. Oh, <laughs> I just murked her. Holy! Nice. Let's kill those droids over there. Ha, ah, dude! That I I don't know if you guys saw that, but that that droid looked for a second. <laughs> He's like, oh crap! And he just gets killed. Dude, everyone's all clustered up over here. Holy. Nice. Dude, what if we win this, like, right now? Oh, my goodness. It looks like that's actually about to happen. Oh! Sick. Come on. There we go. If we actually do win this, I'm actually going to be surprised, because when you play a map that has 300 tickets, you'd expect it to be a little bit lo longer than it already is. <laughs> just pull up the turret just in case someone gets in it. I mean, obviously they have self-heal, so it probably ain't going to matter soon, but... Hey, might as well stop the threat. Oh my goodness, that is a lot of droids down here. <laughs> Alright, maybe we could use an orbital strike down there. Hopefully that does something. Please do something. Oh! Jeez, I just killed the whole squad of them. Could someone help me? Oh my goodness. Oh my god, my teammates are stupid. <laughs> well, I mean, it's Battlefront 2 AI. What do you expect? I don't know. I don't know what I expect. Maybe I expect... Better programmed AI. I don't know. Nice. Freaking heavies. Or security droids with miniguns. Oh, man. Uh, actually, let's be the heavy and blow up the turrets. That's definitely a problem. Ow. Oh, come on. Oh, I screwed up. Dang it. 
Oh, wait, 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 I can just use this imploder. I forgot imploders are basically one-shots for turrets. Ow. Well, took took a couple down. It's alright. Ooh, it could be Ayla again. I'm gonna do that. Ooh, I should actually try out the engineer. Actually, the engineer is probably gonna be the thumbnail, to be honest. Um. But yeah, the engineer has... Or at least, especially in this new patch for the skin changer, the engineers are now updated to when you use the skin changer, they'll go with the legion that you choose. So obviously, instead of saying white, if you pick 501st, they'll actually turn into a 501st engineer when you pick them, which is freaking sick. And I'm dead already again. Oh my goodness. All right, let's yeah. So see, like the engineer is now updated to be a 327th en engineer. With his 327th boyos. Don't know why I'm sounding like an informational guy. Well, I am spreading information. I don't even know. <laughs> Alright. NGs. Yo, what if, what if they bring this engineer back as a skin for the new game? Dude, when uh, when I saw like the news that the El Fabricio was bringing the engine, this engineer especially back for Battlefront Three, I was surprised. Especially since you know this engineer wasn't really in Battlefront Three, but hey, like it's freaking cool. To be honest, I wouldn't mind the pilot having an engineer, or being an engineer anyway. Nice. Damn it. Come on, come on, come on. Please. Jeez, it takes like forever. There we go. Okay. Oh, there we go. Nice. Yeah, Engineer's pretty sick. Love him. Could be Ayla again. Uh, let me see if I can try a different class. Let's be the Airborne Trooper. We haven't been that guy yet. Nice. Oh, we're both sniping over here. Sick. I should be going for headshots to just get quicker kills. Wait, what? So I nicked him? And now he's hiding behind a pillar. Sick. Sick. Wait, is he on a turret? Yeah, he did. Oh my god, I saw that. No, 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 no. Uh, and now he's hiding behind the wall. What is with the droids and being cowards, man? <laughs> Let's be an auto turret. Or not be an auto turret. Use the auto turret. That guy is distracted by something else. Nice. Well, I got quite a few kills. I'm about to die, though. Probably. Looks like I get that. Nice! Like, oh my god, I got him before I died. Sick. Yeah, quite. As long as I get quite a few kills, we can change classes again. Um, I haven't been the Sky Trooper all. Although I think the Sky Trooper, even though it's the last class, I feel like it's one of the more weaker classes because it doesn't. I don't know. He doesn't really do that much damage. And especially with weapons that you'd think would be good for giant groups of to to kill, I don't know. It's just feels really weak in that regard. What in the frick? I mean, he's able to one shot fine, but like you know the reloading, and well, see right now I'm doing all right, but yeah, okay now now the okay there we go. I don't know. I I just feel like this guy just feels weak for some reason. I guess it's just like to go aggressive when you're supposed to like play obviously with high altitudes or jump jump pack a lot and shoot a lot, yeah. Is someone trying to steal Oh Okay, that makes sense. What to say? Ow? 
you mine? Now I lost a bunch of health because of that turret. Oh. Nice. Why are these guys hiding behind the wall? Bro, fight! Your droids are programmed to fight. I mean, same with the clones, but still. Just as a little side note, I still... I don't know, even though I've basically accepted it, because, like, there's no way you can change it unless fucking Disney disowns Star Wars and someone else takes over. Um, and changes the canon again. Um... I don't know. Like, I don't... I still don't really find the inhibitor chip idea to be, like, that... Alright, or good. I mean, like I said, I guess I'm, I'm more accepting of it now, but still, it's just... I don't know, it just feels... It just feels a little weird, cause um, and I was watching one of Super Vader Man's uh, Empire War videos. He basically just summed it up and said like uh, like or a question like, weren't the clones already like obedient to like the uh, to the Republic or to whoever they were serving? So like, why would you why would you need an inhibitor chip to? Well, I mean, yeah, I guess the inhibitor chip would obviously force the clones to kill the Jedi, but still, like, why? Why would you have the? Why would the clones believe in sh trying to shoot down the Jedi, even though they did nothing wrong to them, and they've been serving three years for them? Like I, I don't know. I don't understand. And has grown, has grown especially to these bonds. I don't know. That's why I like the old timeline because, like, it's way more realistic. To be honest. Um, what, the old timeline basically said that, like, the clone, the clones hadn't been indoctrinated to consume as much Republic pro propaganda and protocols as much as possible. So, like, even if, even if, uh, whatchamacallit, even if they, like, you know, had strong bonds with their, with their generals, They'd still have to follow orders from the Republic overall, or whatever, I don't know. I don't know, because, like, obviously no clone would betray their Jedi Masters, or Jedi Generals, right? And, like, in Legends, there's a lot more clones that disobeyed Order 66, so... As of right now... There are only, as of right now in the canon, there's like only like three clones in the, in canon that just didn't obey Order 66, but they had to like, manually, I don't know. I mean, also, I mean, Commander, what was it, Commander Grey in the canon comics actually did also like come around and question. So, I mean, even with the inhibitor chips, you could still have the clones question what they did. But, I don't know. If that's like a rare case, especially when they have the inhibitor chips already implanted in them. I don't know. I don't know, those are my thoughts. I mean, I, I, again, I guess like the inhibitor chips are... I guess the inhibitor chips are more realistic and make sense why the clones just outright just killed the Jedi anyway, but I don't know. Like, that's the thing though, like, in the movie, like, they already stated that the clones were obedient enough. They'll listen to anyone, <laughs> basically. So, like, why do you need inhibitor chips? Why did you just write, why did you write in the in inhibitor chips in? I don't know, I didn't think he needed to do that. You wanna know what I always wondered? Like, I, I wondered, like, where the idea of Order 66 come from. I was trying to look for behind the scenes of Revenge of the Sith on, like, where the idea of Order 66 came from. But, I don't know. As close as I got was just them developing, like, the planets, the different planets, like Felucia and Kashyyyk, for when those things were gonna happen, so. Like, what, because you chose Order 66? Like, does that relate to, like... 
Well, I mean, I, I mean, I always had this th theory. Like, what if like Order sixty six is based off of like the Devils, like six 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 type of thing? I mean, th they're both they have the same numbers, so I mean, it's not a far fetched idea. I don't think. Like, it's like a way of telling that oh, this is death to all Jedi. Whereas, you know, we can go up here. Okay, never mind. This is as far as I can go. Oh, those buildings! Holy jeez. I clearly have not used these buildings correctly <laughs> for my older on map anyway. <laughs> yeah, I need to readjust my older on map a little bit and include more taller buildings or at least uh stack buildings on top of each other like how it's supposed to be in all in this uh cloud city environment. Actually, and uh, I mean, going back to the topic again, I I realized, yeah, there are actually a lot more clones that we know of that disobeyed Order sixty six in Legends and Canon. Because obviously, again, like we know, we know clones aren't gonna stand for fucking Jedi getting killed or whatever, you know, or like killing their own generals after serving them for them for three years. But their ultimate, you know, loyalty is with the. Chancellor, or better yet, just like the Senate and the government, rather than the, the rather than the other ideal. I don't know. I remember like reading this too, like in my in this uh, here Empire comic, Legends comic. It's it basically had a scene from it basically showed a scene of uh, the uh, Dark Lord, the Rise of Darth Vader, but in comic form. Just showed like the Emperor talking to Vader about how like there are clone commandos, there are clone commandos that disobeyed Order sixty six, and he, and then Vader asks like why did they do this, and then Palpatine obviously states it's maybe because of like how it's been three years and they have so much bonds with the Jedi, but because of that like he's still angry and he wants to send Vader to teach them a lesson. Of not of oh, needing to obey to the government rather than the people that you served with. I don't know. I mean, I don't know. The inhibitors kind of did the same thing. Though. I don't know. I guess I just still just like legends is way of doing it or telling that way better. Oh, great. I feel like this video has gone on a little bit long. <laughs> I mean, we only... Oh! And yeah, we only need to kill, like, one ticket left, so... Hmm. Yeah, because of how long this is, I might just leave the droids to another video. Ooh, I think... Ooh, I think I actually know what to do. Um... But yeah, uh, I'm actually gonna go ahead and end off the video here. I would do the dro like like I said, I would do the droids, but I think I'm gonna save that for another vid. Um, but yeah, I'll s may the force be with you guys. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys later. Have a fabulous day. And that was all mixed up. <laughs> yeah, I will see you guys later.